Good girl. Maria. Good girl. Come on, girl. You got it, girl. Good girl. Good girl. Alright guys, so today is uh, Maria's first day going to the vet. She's going to get some vaccines, she's going to get her well check up, you know, and make sure she's healthy, doesn't have any heartworms or, or any of the stuff you don't want an animal to have. Um, yeah, today is going to be a little different when it comes to the hey, vet. I mean, yeah. I'm sure you guys have animals, if you do, and you've been through this situation, so it's completely normal to you, but if you don't... Uh, Due to the COVID laws and stuff, they are not allowing any uh, people coming inside. They're, you got to make a phone call. They're going to come out, get your animal, and then they just call you by phone and give you an update. So I wish, I really wish I could be inside, being with her for a very first time, seeing how she does. Okay. Um, but I'm a, I'm gonna record the conversation and hopefully get the best best type of information out of it all right somebody's gonna give you a call in just a second okay thank you I know it was very hard to just watch her leave like that it's anytime you get too attached to an animal you know it's just like seeing your kid go away for their first time for like first day at school or first first anything and you just want to be every step of the way with them you know and that's how I really felt with Maria and I hope that life gets back to normal just like a little bit or something you know because uh, some of these these rules and stuff is just I feel like in a way it's a little bit too much good how are you doing well so tell me about this little nugget she is so cute thank you um she's <laughs> all i know is she's 10 weeks today so um she okay. doesn't have any vaccines um i do believe her owner or not the owner okay. I, i'm sorry just a second i do believe that the previous um uh, where i got the dog from but he told me that she was dewormed i believe already uh, okay. But no vaccines yet. Oh, okay. So deworming, um, it's kind of a, it's not necessarily a one and done thing. It's more just as needed. Um, so we'll check a stool sample today. So we'll, we'll start everything. Um, you'll be sent home with some free samples, um, a lot of info um, as far as different vaccines that we offer and stuff like that. So as far as today, um, we'll, get her, we'll get her started on her December Parvo adenovirus and parainfluenza combo vaccine. Um, and then she'll start on her Bordetella as well. And then when we see her every three to four weeks, um, you know, we'll go over different vaccines that we offer as she gets older, um, see which uh, exposure that she's going to have. We offer several different vaccines, but it really depends on her exposure with some of those. Um, they're not really core vaccines. It really just depends on where she's going to go in life. Um, but we'll get her started on her heartworm prevention and flea and tick control today. I'll get you some free samples of that. All over everything, and sometimes they can pick up uh, things that, that aren't uh, are meant to be there. But um, as far as the uh, other things that we've got going home with her, uh, Nicole hooked her up with a little puppy kit, and she's got two um, two of her first doses of her flea and tick and her heartworm prevention. Um, so you guys will get those to go home with. Uh, and then as far as I mean, overall, she is a healthy girl. So I didn't know if there was anything in particular you wanted to ask about or have me check on while she's still hanging with us. So. Now that we have gotten the phone call, we got good news about her and we're about to get her back. Um, after we get her, uh, we're gonna go get something to eat. My family and I, we're gonna go get something to eat. And um, uh, it's a good, it's a beautiful day out in the spring day during April. And uh, I think I wanna get her to go out and explore a little bit more and do some more socialization out in public, so. We're gonna have a good time. Here she comes. Here she comes. Should I get out? Hey girl. Thank you. No problem. Mm -hmm. Here's a little puppy bag. It's got all kinds of brochures and samples in it. And okay. all of her medication should be in there as well. Alrighty, thank, thank you. you. Thank you. Hey girl! Hey 
scared of sharks. You have to be back. You ready? You're happy with mama. Come on, girl. So this is a this place good is actually girl. by my house. Maria. Um, good girl. Come I on, thought girl. this was a good little you socialization good area. Girl. Good girl. Because good girl. if it's you can notice girl. right there, the the rocks are pretty steep, and uh, it was challenging for her. She's never been there, and I uh, like to push her to her limit to an extent, you know, and see how well she does. Good girl. Good girl. That's a good girl. Thank you, good girl. Come on. So I left my puppy treats at home on an accident, but that's the best that she did by getting in the water today. So um, I actually tried to get her in the water. I got in the water myself to show her that, hey, we can do this together. It's going to be fun. I didn't actually think she's going to put her paws in the water, but that's a it's a stepping stone, and we're moving towards the right direction. I, I think she's going to be getting out there in no time, wanting to just the be paddled cold, around. Really not that she's going to want to swim when I don't want to swim, you know. Uh, like if it was but warmer, overall, I would she's, get in and I, swim. I love the way she's developing, and I love her hard work that she gives me every single day, and the, everything she wants to do to please me, and all, anything that you want a dog to do, she's you know she's doing it. So. Um, yeah, it's just, we gotta keep on keeping on, you know, and she's gonna grow up to be a badass, so. I just know she loves being with the family, and that is what a dog is supposed to do the most. So, um, yeah, that's today's video. It's time to wrap it up. Drop that comment below, and, uh, let me know what kind of dog video you want to see next and tell me what your dog is or whatever, you know. And, uh, yeah, drop a uh, like below if you like this video. Until next time, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to get going.